Good morning, Hot Tots. Uh, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> I'm always looking real good at the beginning of these videos, or am I not? So it's Saturday morning, doing a little what I eat in a day. Having a little Diet Coke this morning as I wake up. I already fed Ollie, and it's late. It's like 11.30 right now. I let myself sleep in. I woke up at like 5 a.m. as usual, and then was up till 7.00. Went back to bed until 10.30 and then just laid in bed and been watching stuff on my phone. And um, I just wanted to give myself like a lazy morning day because I haven't done that in a while. I still haven't done any type of workout today. And my sister wants me to go. Her birthday's next weekend. And she really wants these candles from this place in downtown Pickerington where I grew up um, called Feather Your Nest. They're open until 4 today. So I was thinking... I might get a little active set on, go for a walk, get a couple miles in this morning, and then go head there. Maybe go get a coffee because pumpkin cream cold brews are out and then head there. So let's get dressed. Let's get ready. Let's get ourselves together. Obviously, I need to put some clothes away, but this is my buff bunny set. So stinking cute. I'm wearing black today for sure. On the agenda today, we're going to get some steps in. We're going to go to Starbucks to get a pumpkin cream cold brew. And we're gonna clean this place up and run some errands. I always spray something on. So these are just the um, Sol de Janeiro um, little mists. This one's pistachio and salted caramel. And then this one is Brazilian jasmine and pink dragon fruit. I love this one the most, the Brazilian jasmine and pink dragon fruit. But I wear this one when I'm not really going to like see anybody or, you know, give a crap what I smell like. This smells good still. It's just not my favorite out of these two. This one's my favorite. But anyways, these are the sprays that I spray on in all my reels and stuff on Instagram. I just like to smell good, even though I'm just, you know, going to work out or whatnot. It just helps me to feel like good, you know? So we're just gonna do a little slick back pony today and put a little sunscreen on. So I'm just gonna put on a little, uh... I was trying this out, the Ilia. This has some SPF 40 in it. It's super serum skin tint. So it's not, I've been using more of like skin tint instead of a full foundation because I don't have a ton of blemishes and that's what you use concealer for, you know? So I don't want a ton on my face, but I want it to still be evened out. So I've been using a little bit of this. It's very runny. So a little bit of that, gotta be very careful. <laughs> And then a little bit of the Drunk Elephant sunshine, sunshine Drops. They're like bronze drops. Really like them. Just one little drop. And I just mix those up. And then I just put that on my face. Like I said, it's really, really watery because it's not like a thick... face cream, but I kind of put it down my neck too, but you can see it kind of bronzes my face a little. See how it's like getting a little darker. So I love that. We love a good bronzing. So it does just enough, which I like. And then if I want to go a little, you know, crazy, I do just a tiny bit of concealer under my eyes. Just put that in there. My stomach is growling, <laughs> but I don't feel hungry. I don't know what's going on. Okay. And then I just do my eyebrows and some lashes and then that's pretty much it for when I'm just, you know, working out, running around. 
when I work out, I usually just put a little concealer on. I don't even put my face makeup on. I just put concealer on since I sweat so much, which is to like liven my face. And then I do eyebrows and eyelashes. Some people don't put makeup on to work out and I don't always, but lately I've been noticing like it makes me feel more confident, you know? Also, I know everyone's been hyping up this Refi lip gloss and it is really cool. I will say that. This thing is really cold because it's like metal. And it feels really good, so I love it. <laughs> and then I've been using the Ilia Mascara. I really love the Ilia Mascara. It does not run on me, so this is a winner. And that's it. I just put a little eyeshadow on. I didn't put any eyeshadow on the brush. I just used whatever was left over, which might be gross, but that's what I do. <laughs> All right, I just put a tank top on. Let's go out. We're going to walk two miles and then we're going to go get coffee. It seems like it's hot outside, so that'll be fun. All right, taking the trash out. Let's go. Someone put their trash in my trash can. Mm-mm-mm. All right, we're doing a quick like one or two miles. It's already like 12, 16. So I wanna be done by one cause I wanna go grab a coffee and then um, head straight to Pickerington, which it takes about 45 minutes for me to get to Pickerington or 30, 40, depending. So I just wanna get there in time to be able to call my sister, get her the candles and stuff she wants and get out of there. So we're gonna take a brisk two mile walk so that I can have it done sooner than usual. Okay, almost done. Almost to my car, I should be at two miles when I get there. And then we're off to get a coffee. Hi, can I get a small pumpkin cream cold brew? And then a turkey bacon cheddar and egg white sandwich. Nope, that's it. I figure I should get something to eat, even though I'm not starving, but it's already one o'clock, so I know I will be hungry soon. I'm excited. Got it. First sip. Yum. Now to get to my papa's, or not my papa's, <laughs> whoops. Feather Your Nest. So Feather Your Nest is where my sister wants me to go get her some candles. It's in Pickerington where I grew up. Oh my gosh, this is stuck to the thing. Ugh. Okay, gotta go. This is the cute little downtown Pickerington. Going up to there. It's so cute around here. Here it is. So freaking cute. It's called Feather Your Nest. Look how cute. So many rooms. So cute. Um. So I just FaceTimed my sister and like got her some stuff. I'll show you guys it when we get home, but the cutest try on room. This is like where you try clothes on. How cute. I love this. Well guys, um, spent a lot of money, got a lot of candles and other things. So I'll show you guys when we get home. I'm gonna go stop at my dad's house and say hi to my family really quick because I'm already here. 
Um, and then we're going to head home and get our errands finished for the day. Oh, that's for Buddy. That looks just like him. Dad, who got you this Buddy wings? The hamburgers in the hub. Oh, oh so my god. The pool looks so nice. Not yet, <laughs> okay, guys, I'm heading home. It is now 4.45. I'm so glad I did have that breakfast sandwich at, what was it, 1.30? Because I would have been starving like Marvin right now, if not. So I've only had, like, that breakfast sandwich was 230 calories, and then a pumpkin cream cold brew is small. I think it's like 100 and some calories. So that's all I've had. So I think for dinner, I think I'm gonna go home, put all this stuff away, and then order some Mexican food. So I'm just gonna think, I think I'm just gonna get like chicken fajitas um, and just eat some chicken fajitas, the rice and whatnot, and that's gonna be my dinner. And then maybe have half a Ninja Creamy for dessert or something. But I had so much fun. Just like I love seeing my dad and my stepmom. And I love going over to their house. And I just went and sat with them. And I put my feet in the pool. I should have brought my swim food. Um, if it's still hot tomorrow, I might go back tomorrow and just lay out at my dad's house. But um, we just like talked, caught up. We're hanging out. I always feel motivated. My dad always like motivates me, you know, to work hard and do all that stuff. So I feel like I'm ready to like, you know, kill it in life. So it was fun. We had a good time. My sister's coming into town next weekend, so I'm so excited. So I'll show you guys what um, she got. She picked it all out, but um, I bought it for her for her B-Day. Cause I, I was gonna actually go to this place. I think I already said this. I was gonna go to this place for her to just pick out some stuff for her cause she loves this store. Um, girls from our school, like I said, opened it and we know them and Mandy loves it there. And when she used to do the crocheting, they actually would sell her crocheted little stuffed animals and stuffies and stuff there. It was really cool. So anyways, um, I'm gonna like get all ready. So that's gonna be my gift to her. I was gonna go there anyways, and now this kind of like worked out perfectly. She gets exactly what she wants, you know? So that's nice. But she's coming in town next weekend. So I was talking to my dad about that. And my dad, Tyler said he would um, smoke a, po a big brisket. My dad got like bought half a cow, as you saw. And so Tyler's going to, I'm gonna get that meat and bring it to Tyler. And Tyler's gonna smoke it for us, for our family on at for Sunday, cause Sunday we're um, doing like the celebrating, you know, of my stepmom's birthday, my sister's birthday, it's Labor Day weekend, all of that. So then we'll still have Monday to like relax and hang out. So it'll be a good time. I'm trying to turn really slow since I have so much stuff in the car. <laughs> um, but anyways, yeah, so I had a great time. I'm excited. I love good Saturday, seeing the family, you know. Um, I have burned 330 calories so far today, so we probably have to do a walk later, but it is just so hot right now, you guys. I'm like, I do not want to be outside, so I might do some indoor walking. All right, now I'm getting some stuff from Kroger. I probably won't record much because my phone is dying. I'm just gonna grab some like fruit, veggies, and then some stuff for Ollie. Guys, I'm finding some really good stuff. <laughs> I'm excited. Go to the grocery store hungry. That's all I have to say. I made it back. I'll show you guys everything I got. Whew. Okay, so here's what I got from the first store. I got this really pretty necklace. I love it. So I bought it. Um, it's really beautiful and I feel like I'll wear it a lot. This is the set I got my sister that she wanted. So super cute, like cream loungy set. Really, really soft material. So she got these pants and then this sweatshirt, which is really cute. It's a little half zip, very soft, like super soft and slinky. I'll link the store below. I think they have an online place too. And then I bought this for myself, which I thought was super cute. Um, let me show you it. It's just like a little like active wear jacket. That's a good, I feel like transition piece. I bought a size medium when I wanted a large, they didn't have one. But the medium is totally fine too because it's like just a little like jogger jacket. Thought it was super cute. Oh, Ollie hairs. It's kind of like meshy feeling. Just a cute jacket. I swear I could wear this. I feel like I could wear this over a sports bra too if I wanted to like wear my sports bras out but then have myself covered. Super cute. So I got this jacket. 
I went too crazy on the candles. So I got one happy fall y'all. It smells so good. Hey there pumpkin. I got one for me and my sister and then unbothered. This is like a really clean scent. These are more like fall. Um, this is, this one's like vanilla E. This one is like spicy. This is like a clean scent. And then this one's also like a clean scent, but like sweet clean. Oh, I love that one. So I bought all of those. So cute. Spent way more than I should have. It's fine. All right. Here's my grocery haul. So I got four of my poppies. I love these. I got the Joseph's lavish bread. I'm going to make a pizza tonight. I decided and not get um, Mexican. This is 60 calories for half. So 120 for the whole thing, 12 grams of protein. I'm going to actually make a little like pizza on here tonight. I got some 45 calorie bread because I want to make some French toast this week. I've been craving it. Some mini bagels. I did get this Danish. You guys know you can eat one eighth of this for 180 calories, or I cut it up sometimes into 16 pieces for less. So you can always grab these bakery items. You guys just divvy it up into different amounts, you know, and I love these Danishes. So I wanted one. This is why you shouldn't be hungry when you go to the grocery store. Tonight for dinner, I might make pizza or I might make this. Now I don't know. So I've been craving this angel hair pasta. My stepmom makes this as a side all the time for us um, at like family events and I crave it. So it's 190 calories per two ounces. There's two and a half um, servings in here. So sometimes I'll eat half of this with like some blackened chicken strips. It's so good. Everyone told me to try the Khalifa Farms cold brew since I don't want to make my own cold brew and that's the only way I could get Dunkin' cold brew. So I'm going to try that. I hope it's like a little more like, you know, nutty flavored because I just feel like Starbucks isn't very flavorful to me. I got the zero sugar pumpkin pie spice because I'm going to start making my pumpkin cream cold brews at home that you guys know I love. I got some buffalo style turkey for this week. Some croissants, they're 100 calories a piece to make little turkey sandwiches. Tons of Ollie's Love Some Treats. I even got him a little Love Some mini thing because if he likes these, then I'll give him wet food every day. Um, but he just doesn't, I've tried 20 different wet foods. He doesn't love them, but he loves those treats. So I'm hoping Love Some is the ticket. Got him some more food. He does the Rachel Ray Nutrition Chicken and Brown Rice recipe. He does not like the indoor recipe, so I don't get him that. I got some pizza sauce for the pizzas. I am lactose intolerant for sure now. So um, I did get this because it doesn't have a lot of mozzarella in it. It has also provolone and Parmesan and Romano. So Parmesan and provolone have low lactose in it. So I still will take lactate before eating this, but I thought this was like a safer cheese to buy. Some pickles, one dill salad kit for a dinner this week. Um, fruit because I want some on hand just to pick at this week and eat. And then I got a ton of these snack packs because I realize I don't eat veggies unless they're in a snack pack. So I get these snack packs. This is 260 calories. So this is like a good snack for in the middle of the day when I don't, or if I can't eat lunch, I'll have this or I'll eat this and have my own ranch on the side. But I got two, just two of the ones like with cheese in it. This has a little turkey stick. This has almonds. And then two, so two almond and turkey, whatever cheese ones and two turkey and cheese ones. So these are 370. So I might take the almonds out some days, you know, and then these are 260. So I bought those and then I got these two little mini snack packs. There's a little chocolate, chocolate caramel, sliced apples and pretzels for like a little sweet snack, 130 calories. Thought those would be really good. They were on sale. And then I got Chobani flips, of course, from Rocky Road, two coffee brownie blisses, a strawberry cheesecake, and a cookie dough. Speaking of cookie dough, can you tell I'm on my period? I bought this two tablespoons is 140 calories for like a quick dessert when you're just like craving cookie dough. Are you kidding me? So good. So that's the haul and now we're making food because i'm starving and i'll figure out what so, i'm doing so dinner's gonna be 400 calories i still have this from trader joe's so i'm just gonna take my lactate and use it i'm doing two servings of the cheese so that's 120 calories i'm doing uh 15 pepperonis half a cup of this pizza sauce and then having the flatbread the um joseph's flatbread so all together be 400 calories i'm gonna cut up a little onion and then just have an onion and pepperoni pizza. I'm also snacking on some fruit right now. So 126 grams is one, is two servings that I'm gonna use, so I'm gonna do a half a cup. Oliver, get out of there. <laughs> so I just like to put it on here and then I just take out until it says 
until I just take out of it until it says 126. I love my saucy sauce. We'll see how much I truly need, I guess. I actually only used, um, well, this is wrong now. Hold on. I only used 108 grams, so it took 10 calories off. So now this is going to be 390 calorie pizza. So added the sauce. Now I'm going to add my 15 turkey pepperonis and then cut this up, add the cheese. We'll see how this looks. So here it is in all its glory. I'm, I have it on 350. I'm just going to plop it in, see how long I need to cook it for, but wait and see. <laughs> I put it for 10 minutes, so just gonna check on it. I'm gonna clean all this up and then we're eating a snack more than just fruit because your girl's real hungry. Okay, we're gonna have a Chobani flip while we wait. This is like 180 calories. It's pretty good on protein, I think too, 10 grams. So, so far today we've only had like 800 calories total and we still have 900 and some left. So, and that's after I already tracked my pizza. <laughs> So we'll definitely have room for a Ninja Creamy tonight, but I definitely need something right now because I'm so, so hungry. So I'm gonna eat this. I tell you what, nothing helps like caffeine. I swear Starbucks like makes me not hungry all day. Ooh, this one looks good. Mmm, can't lose any of the toppings. Mix this bad boy up. So we're gonna eat this and then we're gonna watch a little TV and just relax until our pizza's done. I'm cooking it for like 10 to 15 minutes and then I'm gonna broil it for like a couple minutes too. I like that because it gets the top all crispy and like melty, you know? So. Gonna watch the final episode. I think this is the season finale of, and just like that, season two or wait. Yeah, here we go. So I'm gonna watch that. Broiled it for a little. Looks so good. I'm so excited for this. I uh, measured out a serving of my yogurt ranch and then I'm gonna put some Parmesan on it too since I have extra cows. And then I am gonna add some Italian seasoning as well. Just to, you know, spice it up. Yum. So all together, this is 425 calories with the Parmesan and the ranch. And I am so excited, you guys. Can't wait. Well, we were watching this movie with Lucy Hale in it. It's like, I forget what it's called. It's like they have a really bad first date. Their dogs, or one of their dogs gets pregnant, impregnated by the other one. I don't know, but it looks really cute. So I'm going to watch this now. Oh, it's called Puppy Love. That's what it's called. Okay, so I'm gonna do a serving of this for dessert. So 38 grams is 140 calories. So let's measure that out. Okay. Oh, this is really like thick. It's 28 grams. Just a little bit more. Okay. It's about this much. It's supposed to be like cookie dough, so let's try it out. Mm -hmm. That's good. That's some good stuff. Yum. 140 calories. One gram of protein. <laughs> okay. I am outside walking again. It's really nice out now. It's like in the 70s. Anyways, walking. This guy was like playing golf outside by himself and he like looked at me he was like but you could tell he was like embarrassed he's like out here playing in the back because i walked this way weird way that's like behind all the apartments so people don't really go back here <laughs> it's kind of funny okay we have walked almost two miles ending it now and it is pitch black out but now i'm just gonna fill my water bottle and go to bed i think that's gonna be it for today's vlog you guys um i love you guys so much thanks for coming with me on all of the trips we went on today i'm definitely way under my calories for today so i don't know if i'll just say this is like saturday's vlog and what i eat in a day just so you guys know it's not like my typical as you well you do know drinking some water we got the little bubba's He's so cute.
Come here, Tinker. You want to say bye? Oh, good night. You want extra snack? And by the way, you guys, he did not eat the love some wet food. It's still sitting there. You don't like it. So, I'm just going to give him another treat for tonight, just for funsies. Mm-hmm. You go, Stinky. And that's going to be, sorry, I'm feeding this to him. You slow down, slow down. He eats these so freaking fast. I've been now trying to feed these to him like up because sometimes he eats them so fast and he throws up right after because you know, cats need to be like kind of up when they eat. So I've been trying to do that. But anyways, if you see, he has not touched the love some food. I'm gonna leave it out overnight. If he doesn't eat it, I'm throwing it away. I only bought one, thank the goodness. Cause I knew he probably wouldn't eat it. Anyways, I love you guys so much and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Finally time to shower.